Hey there, this is Ellie with the Delighted team. In this video, we're introducing the link platform, the most adaptable of any distribution method. Let's jump right in. The link platform can trigger a simple study with a single link or launch intricate survey campaigns with multiple links and QR codes working in harmony. Links can be sent down multiple channels simultaneously, launching the same survey via text message, email, video chat, web page, or social media. And the versatility of the platform doesn't stop there. You can create custom links for each of your store locations, product lines, support team members, or any data point that is valuable to you. Add specific properties, like a location ID, product details, and agent name, or add anything else you'd like to filter, segment, and contextualize in your dashboard later on. Setting up the link platform is simple. Just choose Setup in the Link Platform tile on the Platform Selection page. You may need to click the Survey People button first to reopen the Platforms page. Then, walk through the basic customization steps. A full article called Link Platform Customization is located in Section 4, Survey Customization, of this Help Center. When you finish designing your survey, click Next Configure. This will take you to the in-app link builder, which automatically generates your link. And now that we're here, let's showcase our revamped in-app link builder, the tool behind the link platform's flexibility. The in-app link builder organizes more than a dozen link-related features in one convenient place. From this single page, you can rename a link with a mere click of the gear icon. Let's change the name of this link from Ireland to Dublin. Copy a link to your clipboard with a leisurely click and paste it wherever you need it. Identify a link by enabling the vanity URL. Appending names to the end of the URL strings will make your links easily distinguishable from one another. Don't forget to click Save to append the flag. Download a QR code by clicking your preferred image format. Add properties. Let's add a manager named Sean. Continue adding as many properties as you like, such as employee ID or an office location. Remove a property with a quick click. Customize your survey's look and feel by clicking Customize Appearance. Pick Get Individual Links for Each Score to generate a link for each score point in your survey, like these five links for this CSAT survey. And finally, ensure up-to-date feedback by deleting any links you no longer need. Oh, and don't forget to save. After you create or modify a link, click the Back to Links breadcrumb at the top of the page. This takes you to the Your Links list, where you can review all of the URLs you've generated for your project. You can also reach this page by clicking Adjust Settings under the link tile on the platforms page. The Links page is also your portal back to the in-app link builder. Return to your links list at any time by clicking Survey People, followed by Adjust Settings in the link platform tile. Click Settings to edit an existing link. Let's reopen our Dublin link and enable its vanity URL. After saving your changes, click Back to Links to see the result. Pick Add a new link to add another URL and QR code to a survey campaign. Let's add a Paris location. What better way to enjoy the City of Lights than to open a storefront on the Champs-Élysées? Let's test our new Paris link. One. We'll copy the Paris link by clicking the Copy icon to the right of the URL from either the in-app link builder or from the links list. Two, paste your link into your browser and press Enter. Three, take your survey. Easy enough. But there's a little secret we should let you in on. The in-app link builder has a feature called Prevent Multiple Submissions. This setting places a cookie in the respondent's browser, limiting them to one survey response per month, which helps avoid oversampling. If a respondent takes a survey multiple times, only the most recent answers will be recorded and previous responses are discarded. What's our best advice then? Use an incognito browser for testing to avoid that cookie. However, if this one month cookie period isn't going to work for your study, there's a simple fix. Open your in-app link builder and remove the check next to prevent multiple submissions. Voila! Your respondents can answer as often as they like and you can run as many tests as you wish from a normal browser window. Link surveys are anonymous by design, which is important when studies require privacy. Results will appear in the dashboard with the word person followed by a numerical identifier, such as 11414551142, in parentheses. 
the number allows anonymous results to be filtered on the dashboard, displayed on permalink pages, and aggregated into reports. If you need to pass or collect names and email addresses with your links, learn how it's done in the print portion of this article under the heading The Value of Anonymity. Well, that's it for now. Join us later for a video detailing how to add properties to your links, a hot topic that you won't want to miss. We'll see you then!